हेलो एवरीवन एंड वेलकम टू इंस्टेंट बायोलॉजी बाय डॉक्टर नीलाभ आज जिस टॉपिक के ऊपर हम बात करने जा रहे हैं वो है एमटेक बायोटेक्नोलॉजी के कोर्सेज और एमटेक जो एलाइड सब्जेक्ट्स हैं अपार्ट फ्रॉम बायोटेक्नोलॉजी दोज कोर्सेज दैट आर ऑफर्ड थ्रू द गैट बी एग्जामिनेशन सो ऑल इन ऑल वी वुड बी डिस्कसिंग अबाउट द मास्टर्स दैट इज़ द एम टेक I would be providing another video for the MSc courses so this video is specifically for MTech courses through GATT B examination so in this video we would be discussing about the seats about the eligibility criteria and i would also be telling you that according to my uh, thinking which college is the best and if you get a top rank what colleges should you opt for and which college can give you proper uh, if you are looking for a job for job prospects or for uh, research prospects which colleges can be good so let us start our discussion let us start this video with the first college that is providing the mtech biotechnology or allied sciences courses this is cochin university of uh, science and technology so this is also called as cu sat the college or the university is present in uh, kerala and uh, it is providing a course on mtech marine biotechnology so see this is a very very specific course as uh, you can see the name so this would be specifically in marine biotechnology if i talk about the eligibility criteria then this is very simple so the student should have btech or be degree in biotechnology and also msc students are also eligible if they have a degree in any life science uh, branch okay so they would be eligible for mtech uh, biotechnology that is mtech marine biotechnology so if you have any questions that you wish to ask you can contact uh, uh, professor valasamma joseph this is the email id of uh, the concerned uh, a professor and these are the number of seats total 20 seats are there now coming to the next uh, institute this is indraprasth institute of information and technology so if i talk about this this is located in delhi so the heart of the country if you are interested in uh, or if you are living around delhi or ncr region and also if you have keen interest in computational biology because this university or this institute is basically offering the course in computational biology so i don't know i mean uh, very i have seen that not many students are interested in computational biology but in my uh, perspective in my opinion this computational biology is a really good growing field you can opt for this if you have interest so the email id of the concerned person is uh, bagler at the rate of iiitd at uh, .ac.in and the concerned person is dr ganesh okay uh, let us quickly talk about the eligibility criteria so b tech and be in cs it maths and computing apart from this there are other eligibility criteria as also so b tech be in any other discipline also can be allowed that means if you are uh, biotechnology or uh, any other discipline and you want to pursue bioinformatics you can do this uh, from this uh, college indraprasth institute of information and technology the number of seats over here is 15 okay so now let us move on to the next one so just let me just quickly write down computational biology okay now let me quickly move down and this is institute of chemical technology so this uh, institute is basically offering multiple courses so the first course that is being offered is mtech bioprocess technology mtech bioprocess technology and uh, the name of the institute is ict mumbai so the location is mumbai Institute of Chemical Technology Mumbai the name of the concerned person is Dr Ratnesh what are the eligibility criteria so btech in uh, these uh, this course basically takes in people from chemical engineering people from pharmacy and also 
people from biotechnology that means biotechnology biochemical engineering biomedical engineering all of these people are eligible so you don't have to worry if you are a biotechnology student so this is uh, a, a nice course the number of seats over here is 30 so I personally recommend this course very much why because you see bioprocess technology is the need of the hour everything that is related to fermentation industry fermentation industry can be learnt in this particular course and because of this the job prospects are very high okay so the job prospects for this particular after doing this particular course becomes very high in the actually in the fermentation industry right plus this course would also offer you a uh, exposure to uh, multiple uh, what do you say multiple fields multiple areas of practical applicability so that is why I personally re highly recommend if you are a top ranker in GATB and you are looking for uh, this uh, uh, MTech courses then I personally highly recommend this particular course MTech bioprocess technology okay so this is the first course that uh, I mean to say if you are a top ranker according to me I would refer this as the first course okay let us move on to the next one again this as I have said that uh, Institute of Chemical Technology would be offering uh, multiple other courses also so apart from this you can see this is a course in food biotechnology mtech food biotechnology again the Institute is ICT Mumbai and the name of the concerned person is professor Lakshmi okay next what are the eligibility criteria again the individuals who have done their BTech or BE in biotechnology are eligible so you need not to worry that uh, if you are eligible for food food biotechnology or not of course you are eligible right so this is the mtech food biotechnology course again I highly recommend this also why because uh, you see the next good area to work in is food industry food industry um, is, is always booming right you can always do new things in the food industry it's always booming so if you are looking for jobs after your mtech then this is or this can be a good branch for you so this has also good job prospects okay the number of the seats are little less than the uh, previous uh, the the previous seat that was bioprocess that had 30 seats over here only 10 seats are present so this was about uh, mtech food biotechnology in ict mumbai now this is the third course that is being offered by the same institute and the name of the course is pharmaceutical biotechnology okay let me just highlight it quickly pharmaceutical biotechnology ict mumbai again the same institute and uh, the name of the concerned person is professor pa prajakta if you need to contact her the email id has been uh, given over here and what are the eligibility criteria are the biotech students eligible eligible of course they are so btech biotechnology if you have done your btech in biotechnology you are of course you are eligible for other graduates who have done uh, different courses they can check out their eligibility criteria from this particular pdf if you want i can uh, just uh, uh, send this PDF as an attachment to you or I can just upload it to my uh, Google Drive and I can share the link on the de in the description box also right so this was about uh, pharmaceutical biotechnology you see I rank both the food biotechnology and the pharmaceutical biotechnology equally okay so I would rank food biotechnology and the pharmaceutical biotechnology equally uh, the number of seats over here is again 10 okay so this FT food biotechnology and pharmaceutical biotechnology I would rank equally so first number would be for uh, the, the, the the bioprocess and the second number would be food biotechnology and pharmaceutical biotechnology this should be the case and if I talk about this uh, the next one this is uh, KS Rangasamy College Technology Tamil Nadu so the location is again in Tamil Nadu location is in Tamil Nadu so you should keep in keep this in mind if this is very far off a place from your from your uh, 
city or from uh, where you are present so you can look for other options or you can uh, just opt for this also this college offers mtech in biotechnology and the concerned person is dr robinson okay so this uh, is the email id of the concerned uh, authority the number of seats over here is 10 previously also i just i, I believe i forgot yeah uh, no so in the previous course also the number of seats were 10 so definitely if the mtech biotechnology course is there so the eligibility criteria would be btech in biotechnology so that is not at all a problem you can uh, directly join this ks ranga Samui college now in the next uh, one you have uh, Maulana Abul Kalam Azad University of Technology this is in West Bengal okay so the location is in West Bengal and uh, mtech in biotechnology professor Arup Mukherjee is the person who is the authority you can contact him with the email ID mentioned over here number of seats over here are quite good that is 30 okay so BE or btech in biotechnology is uh, the course over here and finally uh, the this next one is Pondicherry University mtech in computational biology so if you remember we have already seen a university offering course in computational biology that was IIT, IIIT Delhi that is the Indraprast Institute of Information Technology in Delhi uh, the concerned person over here is Professor Lakshmi you can contact her at this particular email ID so again if it is in uh, bioinformatics so let me let let us just quickly check out that whether biotechnology students are eligible or not so btech or be degree in biotechnology that means uh, this eligibility criteria is not a problem the seats are also uh, in ample so that is also not a problem last is a uh, well tech uh, college that is again in Tamil Nadu so we have already seen two colleges in Tamil Nadu right so the previous one was the KS Rangasamy College in Tamil Nadu and this last one Welltech Rangarajan uh, Dr. Saguntala R&D Institute of Science and Technology this is also in Tamil Nadu Professor uh, Manoj is the concerned person over here you can directly get in touch with him and the course that is offered over here is mtech in biotechnology with specialization in industrial biotechnology so this again is a uh, added advantage over here because industrial biotechnology in my opinion would uh, give you added advantage added advantage because it would prepare you for the industry in my opinion and uh, because if for those of you who are looking for jobs after their mtech you need to be industry ready so this course might uh, uh, prove an added advantage to you so apart from this again btech in biotechnology is the eligibility criteria so that is again not a problem so what i would want if if i were you what i would do is i would i have these number of options but you see i if i get a top rank in this gateway examination i was i would definitely i the courses offered from ict okay so in my opinion i would definitely i the courses offered from ict the first one would be bioprocess the second one would be uh, food and uh, the f food food technology and pharmaceutical so this these courses after this see i have a keen interest in computational biology i have a keen interest in that so in my opinion i would go for computational biology so i could uh, go for indraprastha university indraprastha uh, institute of information technology that is iiit triple it delhi and uh, then i can go for uh, pondicherry university if, if i if you are interested in uh, computational bio bioinformatics because i am in interested in that so i would have gone for uh, pondicherry university and then i would have opted the industrial biotechnology course that is present in welltech industrial biotech so that was present in the la that was the last one that was uh, in welltech industrial biotechnology so these would be the uh, this would be the actually the series that i would opt for 
if you are not getting these colleges then you can opt for the other colleges as well that is not a problem because you would be getting the the fellowship equal fellowship in each of these uh, colleges and you never know what rank you would be getting so depending upon the rank you can opt different colleges but i would definitely be eyeing these uh, seats so in total you can see for mtech biotechnology total seats for mtech biotechnology are 165 so that means there are ample of seats ample of seats that you can uh, work with i would really wish you all the best for the exam and uh, uh, do good okay so that was all for this particular video i would upload an, a new video for the msc courses uh, which might be useful for you if you if you like the video if you really like the video just press the like button and uh, subscribe my channel thank you so much have a good day